हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज नरेश आई एस अकेडमी डिजिटल प्लेटफॉर्म आई एम प्रोवाइडिंग कंप्लीट वीडियो लेक्चर सीरीज ऑन राजस्थान जीके एंड जीएस फॉर इंग्लिश मीडियम स्टूडेंट्स यू कैन टेक हेल्प फ्रॉम अवर अदर कोर्सेज लाइक द राजस्थान आर्ट एंड कल्चर हिस्ट्री ऑफ राजस्थान आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस ऑन माई यूट्यूब चैनल एंड हिंदी मीडियम स्टूडेंट कैन ऑल्सो टेक हेल्प द एंटायर राजस्थान जी के जी एस ऑलरेडी डिस्कस एंड दिस इज द थर्ड सीरीज ऑन ज्योग्राफी ऑफ राजस्थान टूडे आई विल डिस्कस द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ सॉइल्स इन राजस्थान एंड द प्रॉब्लम्स ऑफ सॉइल्स सॉइल्स ऑफ राजस्थान If you are a candidate for IAS exam, then definitely you must visit our website and YouTube channel. On YouTube channel, I have discussed the IAS mains exam, GS paper one and GS paper two entirely. So definitely it will help you a uh, too much extent. And you may also contact for the offline classes. Soils of Rajasthan, first. the various types various types of soils in which we will understand the new types or the new classification of soils and the traditional or conventional types of soil second problems of soil in rajasthan what are the major problems major problems of soils in rajasthan one is soil erosion and second is salinity and alkalinity and through the map of rajasthan we can locate the geographical distributions of soils ओके क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ द सॉइल्स इन राजस्थान एज वेल एज इन इंडिया तो देर आर द टू मेथड्स ऑफ क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ द सॉइल्स वन इज द कन्वेंशनल और ट्रेडिशनल और सेकेंड इज द न्यू क्लासिफिकेशन which is according to the international organization and india is also a party of this organization that's why india have also adopted this and being a part of india rajasthan also believe in the new classification or types of soils so this is our responsibility to understand and learn what are the new classification because in the previous year in the various exam Rajasthan Public Service Commission have been asked so many question that's why it is a compulsion anyhow we have to understand this so then the new classification or traditional classification first of all we can divide the entire Rajasthan 
under the four regions this is the arid climatic regions and the new classification of soils in this region which is named as arido soils arido soils okay then third desert or the western rajasthan includes the arido soils the type of the new classifications of the soils and the mid part of the rajasthan or we can say the geographical extent of the arabli mountain region or which comes under the new classification of the insepti soils insepti soils okay and the third which is the humid or sub humid region and it falls under the alfi soils alfi soils and the fourth is the southern part of rajasthan and this is the hardoti plateau and which comes under the varti soils varti soils mainly the hardoti region bara jhalawad kota and this is the बांसवाड़ा डूंगरपुर प्रतापगढ़ चित्तौड़ एंड द सदर्न पार्ट ऑफ द उदयपुर डिस्ट्रिक्ट तो दिस इज द न्यू क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ द सॉइल्स इन राजस्थान तो अकॉर्डिंग टू डिस्ट्रिक्ट क्वेश्चन आर आज सो यू हैव टू लर्न दिस इन विच जियोग्राफिकल और क्लाइमेटिक रीजन द न्यू टाइप्स ऑफ द सॉइल्स इज फाउंड सेकेंड द ट्रेडिशनल क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ सॉइल्स इन राजस्थान okay the traditional so then traditional part is prevailing throughout the country not only in rajasthan mainly so there are the so many types of the traditional pattern of the soils one is sandy soil sandy soil you know sandy soil is the largest soil group of rajasthan because it is extending the most of geographical area of rajasthan further the sandy soil is divided into the saline sandy soils and the serosum sandy soils and now we can locate this is the arido soils or the arid region comes under the sandy soils entire part and the geographical region of the pali district and the nagor district western part of ajmer this is the seeker junjunu and churu this part uh, comes under the a uh, serosum soils serosum soils and the saline sandy soils mainly covers this the geographical boundary of barmer district and here this is the jaisalmer and jodhpur bikaner and some part of the gangnagar and western hanumangarh sandy saline soil the sandy soils cover the saline sandy soil and the serosum soils okay the next traditional class classification is the black soil 
ऑल्सो कॉल्ड द चर्नोजम सॉइल ब्लैक सॉइल्स ब्लैक सॉइल्स आर मेनली फाउंड एट द हाड़ोती प्लेट्यू और इन द साउथ ईस्ट राजस्थान तो ब्लैक सॉइल इज एक्सटेंडिंग इन बारा कोटा बूंदी झालावाड डूंगरपुर बांसवाड़ा प्रताप चित्तौड़गढ़ एंड सम पार्ट ऑफ द सदर्न उदयपुर ओके तो दिस इज द बेल्ट ऑफ द ब्लैक सॉइल साइंटिफिकली चर्नोजम सॉइल्स आर कॉल्ड द ब्लैक सॉइल एंड इट हैज फॉर्म बाय द लाबा सो इट इज कॉल्ड द लाबा सॉइल्स एंड द थर्ड इज रेड सॉइल समटाइम कॉल्ड द रेड लोमी सॉइल रेड सॉइल रेड लोमी सॉइल दिस इज फाउंड मेनली इन द सदर्न राजस्थान इन द सम पार्ट ऑफ द उदयपुर एंड द डूंगरपुर बांसवाड़ा चित्तौड़ एंड द भीलवाड़ा ओके तो रेड सॉइल एंड द रेड लोमी सॉइल एंड देर इज अ मिक्सचर ऑफ रेड एंड द ब्लैक सॉइल सो This is a next subcategory, the red and black soil found in the Haroti Plateau. In the some interior part of these districts, have the red and black soil. Okay, and the next traditional classification is the brown soil. The brown soil in Rajasthan. Brown soil mainly are found in the basin area of Banas River. in the previous videos i have uh, completely discussed the uh, origin of the different rivers their drainage pattern so then banas river originate in the khamnor region khamnor region of the rai saman district and its flows along with the rai saman then udaipur districts and bilwada bilwada district then tonk madhopur sabai madhopur So then the drainage area or the basin area of Banas River covers the brown soil in Rajasthan. So this is the brown soil and the alluvial soil. You know alluvial soils mainly are found in the eastern Rajasthan. So then the part of the Jaipur, then Alwar district, Bharatpur, Dhawalpur, Karoli, Madhopur, and Dosa. So this belt is un comes under the of uh, alluvial soil so then these are the main traditional types of the soils in rajasthan next part is what are the various problems of soils in rajasthan so then various problems first is the most of soils of rajasthan are facing the problem of the soil erosion you know erosion is a a process of uh, displacement and shifting the upper layer of soils uh, to the another place and the soil erosion may be uh, through the wind high speed wind and the water so the two important types of soil erosion are found in rajasthan the erosion by wind or erosion by the water western rajasthan the third desert is completely comes under the wind erosion the due to the wind er erosion most of sand dunes are formed in this region sand dunes or between the sand dunes sometime these are uh, called the playa or the lagoon lakes in the interior area of the sand dunes the water is stored and it uh, convert into a playa lakes mostly are found in the jaisalmer and the badmer district second is the erosion by the water there are so many rivers flows through the different district of rajasthan but the chambal river is very notorious for the water erosion and ravine lands ravine lands mainly are created by the chambal river and you know chambal originates from the madhya pradesh but enter into rajasthan from the Chit Chittorgarh district and is flows through the Kota district, then Madhopur, Karoli, or Dhawalpur, or it comes out from the Dhawalpur and enter into the Uttar Pradesh. And the Chambal River historically have created most of the ravine lands 
and it is mainly accountable for the water erosion. So, the uh, land uh, surrounding the Chambal river is not fertile and is, it is sometimes called the weird land or the ravine lands. So, th so, this is the one of the most problems in Rajasthan. However, government is taking uh, so many steps, state government and union government also providing technical or the financial support and there are so many methods are using for protecting the soil erosion then these methods I will discuss in the another videos. Second problem of the soils of Rajasthan is the some soils are converting into the saline soil or the alkaline soil acidity or alkalinity are found in the soils. In the best Rajasthan due to the Indra Gandhi canals we have provided water for irrigation for drinking purpose or industrial purpose or the domestic purpose. But due to the Indra Gandhi canal there is a problem of salinity and acidity have emerged because due to the uh, eternal water logging the lower layer of the earth lower layer of earth or soils uh, which stores so many chemicals or elements like the sodium chloride manganese magnesium and these elements or chemicals uh, comes above the uh, soil surface in the top soils due to the capillary action so mainly the western rajasthan is facing these two kinds of problem however these problems are identified or traced in the interior part of the rajasthan and government have started the use of gypsum use of gypsum to fight the problem of salinity and alkalinity the so, these problems are mainly the major concentration of the sodium chloride and this salt comes above the soil surface due to the capillary action okay and the some other uh, problems of the soils of rajasthan are the uh, degradation of soils which means uh, most of areas it have uh, search that uh, soils have lost its nutrition level so the soils are losing its fertility rate and this is uh, becoming due to the uh, excess use of nitrogen fertilizers and the in scientific uh, agriculture cultivation and government also is taking some steps and uh, providing awareness of the scientific manner to the peasants and farmers and uh, you know the government of India introduced soil health card scheme in Rajasthan first the country from the Suratgarh region of the Ganganagar district in 2013 and 14 it was in, uh, introduced and executed. So then soil health card scheme first introduced in Rajasthan throughout the country through which uh, scientists have collected the samples of different types of soils in Rajasthan and they have tested this and they have pointed out the major problems of the soils of Rajasthan and according to which both the governments collectively are taking the so many steps to measure the problems okay so then this is the <coughs> classification of the soils and various problems of the soils in Rajasthan and what kind of steps are taken by the governments okay thank you